Good morning, guys. Welcome to PETV. My name is Coach Ben, and today is Winning Wednesdays. Now, the name of our session today is called This or That. So I'm going to ask you some completely random questions, and you have to answer whether it's this or whether it's that. Okay? Very, very simple. If you get it correct, you only have to do 20 of an exercise. If you get it incorrect, however, you have to do 30. So it's a little bit, a little bit tough. Okay? Further. The first question is, what has more calories? A McDonald's cheeseburger or eight bags of carrot sticks? Imagine how many carrot sticks that is, eight bags of carrot sticks, okay? So what has more? Have a little think, carrot sticks, burger, or burgers, you know, more carrot sticks. I can reveal to you that the items or items that have more calories is the cheeseburger, okay? Cheeseburger has 300 calories, whereas the eight bags of carrot sticks only have 272 calories, okay? So if you got that right, you only have to do 20. If you got it incorrect, you have to do 30. Now I'm always gonna do 30, just so I can do it with everybody. First exercise we have got is star jumps. We all know star jumps, everyone's done them before. Let's get ready to go. And off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Oof. Good start, great little burner to start. On to question number two. Okay, it's quite tough. What's faster, a peregrine falcon or a full focus? So a peregrine falcon is actually the world's fastest bird and full focus is a car. So your mum or your dad might drive it to work, anybody, okay? but we all know how fast cars can go. Have a little think. The answer is, or the correct answer, is the Peregrine Falcon, okay? It actually travels at high speeds of 200 miles an hour, whereas the Ford Focus only goes 155. So it's actually quite a little bit of a gap in between that 45 miles an hour, right? right. If you got that right, very well done. If you got it wrong, have to do 30 with me. Now, the exercise we're gonna be doing are floor to sky jumps, okay? So touch the floor and reach for the sky. Ready? 30 of those. This could be tough. Ready? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Some of you start twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine. 30, Whew. very, very, very well done. On to the next, the next one. What do you think is taller? The world's strongest, uh, not strongest, the world's tallest man ever, or an Amazon delivery van? So have a little thing, Amazon delivery vans are pretty big. You know, you get a parcel, you look out the window, you see this big massive van with all the parcels in the back, or the world's tallest ever man who was pretty tall. What do you think? Now, if you chose the Amazon delivery van, you were incorrect. The world's tallest man was actually just slightly taller. Well, I say slightly, 
quite a bit taller. He was eight foot 11 inches tall. So that is very, 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 very tall. If you know me, I'm six foot three inches tall. So I was a lot shorter than him, but the Amazon delivery van was seven foot nine inches tall. So a little bit of a difference. Right, well done if you got it correct. Only 20 of an exercise for you. This exercise is squats. So I'm gonna do 30. Let's get it going, ready? And off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Excellent job. That's 30 squats done and dusted. Right, on to the next one. Now, who or what is older? The world's oldest person ever to exist or the fridge, the invention of the fridge. Do you think the fridge is older or younger than the world's oldest person? I'll give you a second to have a little think. Oof. Right, if you said the world's oldest person was older, you would be correct. They were 122 years old, whereas the fridge created in 1913, is only 109 years old. So pretty close to be fair, not too far out. However, if you got it wrong, you have to do 30 of an exercise with me. If you got it right, only 20. Okie dokie. Right. This time we're doing spotty dogs. Okay. Give it a try. And off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 29, 30. Oof. Very well done getting towards the end, right? This one is about some Olympians. So who has more Olympic gold medals? Usain Bolt or Michael Phelps? So Usain Bolt, as we know, is a very, very, very fast sprinter. And Michael Phelps is a very, very, very fast swimmer. So who do you think has more gold medals? Answer is Michael Phelps. So Michael Phelps has 23 gold medals, which is absolutely outstanding. Whereas Usain Bolt has eight, which don't get me wrong, is amazing as well. So if you guess Michael Phelps, congratulations. If you guess Usain Bolt, still a good thing because you get to do more exercise. Now, the... Thing we are going to be doing our lateral jumps so hands will be placed on our hips and then our feet go out side to side okay so i've got 30 of those ready and off we go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Ooh, good stuff. On to the last two. So, okay. This one's a bit of a football question. So, who has more World Cups, Brazil or Italy? Now, 
Both teams are very, very, very good. They've both had their fair share of World Cup glory. Okay, so have a little think. Who's got more, Brazil or Italy? Answer is Brazil. Brazil have got five, whereas Italy only have four, okay? Brazil obviously have a chance to get another one this winter in Qatar, whereas, you know, Italy, they didn't quite make it into the World Cup, so unfortunate for them. Right, if you got it right, 20. If you got it wrong, 30. We've got heel taps, okay? Let's give it a go. Ready? And off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 12, 13, 14, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Oh, that was quick. Good stuff. If you're still going, keep going. Come on, I just have a look at the very last question. Okay, right. Last one. What is further away from me or you right now? Would it be Mount Everest or the North Pole? Okay, what do you think? Mount Everest or the North Pole? Now, they are both very, very far away. That's what you think might be slightly further. Have a little think. Okay, now I can tell you that the North Pole is actually further away. So that's about 6,000 miles away, whereas Mount Everest is about 4,000 miles away. So about 2,000 miles in between, which is actually a lot. Right, we are going to do punches to finish off so nice quick punches if you got it right you have to do 20 if you got it wrong you have to do 30 okay so get them off nice and quick okay ready let's go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine thirty 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. oh very 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 well done ah. If you've got a drink on hand, grab yourself a very well-deserved drink. Have a little sip. Excellent, that was brilliant. Well done to all of you guys that joined in. Now, I hope to see you the same time next week. Stay good, stay safe, stay healthy. See you later.